Hello YouTube. So I said I was back and then I didn't make a video for a while. Um, I'm really excited because um, I've, it's the week before the Supernova experience which is the first live event using um, you know storytelling uh, as a platform for you know personal transformation and personal growth and entrepreneurship <clears throat> and really uh, turning your story into art and I've been working um, with my clients since last year in really crafting their story and even publishing books and some of them already had books but really crafting the story of why this has supported them right and you know creating a community around their story of, of resilience um, and whether I liked it or not uh, due to my own background and my own story, um, I worked with women that are other trauma survivors and sexual abuse survivors. And um, my SSEE program that I developed was, you know, the culmination of the last seven years mm -hmm. of coping and going through my own work and found what worked for me, um, not only as an artist and, and making a living uh, with different business models, and um, but also you know, maintaining mental health and um, community and support that is in a boundary way, especially for sexual abuse survivors um, and trauma survivors, that their boundaries may have been separated. So um, it's very, very interesting. And I've just connected with um, Dr. Jordan B. Peterson's work um, and self-authoring program, which is amazing. And I found that it's kind of like the in-depth, if depth psychology was, you know, turned into my five-day storytelling challenge, which um, I have a few members, or a few people that I am in contact with that I am in part of a study group with the self-authoring program. And um, they're doing my five-day storytelling challenge, and they say it's kind of like a really nice overview of creating your story. And um, Dr. Jordan Peterson's work you know, in creating different chapters or epochs of your life, so past you, present you, future you, and having those dialogues between yourself um, is, is just fascinating um, and just very, um, very good for me to to hear to hear that background, right? And my old my old process though is also including entrepreneurship and economic empowerment. Um, and uh, entrepreneurship training in, in, within my own coaching practice, since I, I do mainly coaching, right? And I do my artwork in that too, but, you know, to support other people, facilitate and, and mentor them through the um, SSAE program. So um, I wanted to pop in and just share my experience with the present authoring, because I'm doing the present authoring program right now, and I'm just finding and noticing just within starting the program, my own self-discipline has increased. My um, meta layer, as one of my mentors said, every morning just, you know, making the bed. I know Dr. Jordan Peterson's a big fan of that. Um, making the bed, doing my yoga practice, doing my journaling in the morning, my artwork. So, uh, you know, every morning keeping my, my journal at the hand and my pencils and everything ready. Um, very, very important for mental well-being and, and growth um, and then checking in with with my clients uh, during the week so um, just within that and getting clear on my virtues and not not going into the negative of usually the present virtues and things uh, I would have labeled as negative like it being too much or um, loving you know, performing and, you know, being on the spotlight and that as, as a negative, um, where you're really, there's, I think, 20 or 30 different virtues that you go through and you select the ones that are um, the ones that you value and the ones that you've embodied the most. And then you write an essay on that and then you write a deeper essay on that. And then how can that virtue or that aspect of your personality support you in your life? Um and move you forward in your life personally, but also within your relationships and then within community. So it's a very integrative and long form approach um, that I am excited to facilitate since I am now an affiliate of 
the self-authoring program within my own Singularity Circle. And Singularity Circle is a um, online uh, membership community portal uh, where I facilitate the conversation, but also get accountability for people as a coach um, to move people forward towards their goals. And not only that, but get clarity on especially the slightly future version of themselves that you know they're entrepreneurial, they're artists, they're self-expressed, very much about the radically conscious self-expression, freedom of that self-expression, both in online and on offline communities and earning a living from that self-expression because really that is what artists are, <laughs> right? And there are so many different models now for doing this through Patreon or my model is similar to Patreon but it's, it's separate from Patreon um, through the Singularity Circle membership and the different perks that are involved with that and then my mentorship program um, where I kind of guide and track progress based on the story and the virtues that you're creating for a slightly future you to reach those goals so it's very very important for me to you know honor those for for the clients but also give as many tools as possible so that you can reach your goals and doing the self-authoring program just the present virtues one is giving me so much clarity on this and if you're not familiar with dr jordan peterson's uh work i highly recommend you watch some of his lectures um on youtube um he even has a lecture on um, kind of uh, breaking down and deconstructing uh, the Bible stories in a way that you know it's, it's kind of redefining what the divine is, which is very similar to my perspective on the divine, um, and kind of this this moving forward to not necessarily perfection, but um, something that you define as per perfection. There's that saying, right? You you move forwards among you you aim for the aim for the moon but you'll still land among the stars kind of thing and then the divine is the moon and the stars are still around it but you've still like conquered yourself and moved beyond yourself to reach your goals right um which is super important um to live a full and meaningful life <laughs> you know um and this is why um the supernova experience is coming out from all of this, you know, the last 10 years of, of you know, being involved in the entrepreneur space, digital nomad, lifestyle design, um, self-directed learning space, because I would attend conferences and people would be very excited and, and very high up on, you know, like all these inspirations and motivations, but what would happen is the conversation would end and it would not be sustainable. And um, those changes, that inspiration, it, it, you know, it, it flickers out. So how do you create sustainable habits and changes? And I found that, for me anyway, it was mentorship, community, accountability, um, and always going back to your original story. You know, and for me at the time, and why I developed the 5-Day Storytelling Challenge, I'll have a link down below was because the only thing that was helping me get out of my own depression was looking at what are the two things that are, you know, that just still light me up, even though I was, nothing else was lighting me up. Um, and it was traveling the world and helping people. And I've shared this story many times in many podcasts, but really, you know, those are the two things that got me out of my depression it was doing and creating and generating um, and learning and self-directed learning became, you know, my motivator and learning, you know, whatever I could absorb was, was what was exciting for me. So, um, understanding that, um, traveling the world and helping people that led me down the digital nomad path. And then I got to the place of realization, oh, I don't have depression anymore. <laughs> And also realizing, you know, the seven years of the original idea to making it happen, you know, a lot of luck, a lot of opportunities, a lot of being in the right place at the right time, a lot of support or finding support, a lot of investments in mentorship and education um, was very, very important uh, for me and for my own learning. So Singularity Storytelling came out of 
that seven years of experience, or that epoch, as Dr. Jordan Peterson would say, and moving out of that, um, created my own methodology. And what I've learned being in the online space and offline space, multimedia, art uh, space, and seeing that that is, you know, really, really important. Um, in uh, stepping out of our comfort zones. So I'm going to pop in on YouTube and give my two cents on um, the self-authoring program because I I adore it. Um, it's If anything, it's giving my own mental health in check as, you know, you're organizing any kind of big event and um, making sure that things are taken care of. So um, if anybody has any questions on self-authoring program, I will include also my affiliate link down below. So that means... I will get a, a, a proceed of the profit if you buy it, so I do appreciate that. And um, if you are interested in, you know, sustainably, you know, shifting out of, I can't say depression, you know, but I, I can only speak from my own personal experience. Um, that that's partially why I developed the, the, the five day storytelling challenge and SSEE and work with the people that I work with because. And you find something that is greater than yourself and, you know, the, the longing for experience in life is greater than the, um, you know, ending of your life and ending of the pain. Uh, it's um, way more um, powerful, you know, before you get too nihilistic. <laughs> so... Um, yeah, those are my two cents. I highly recommend the self-authoring program. There are different modules for it. Um, but we'll see, you know, in a couple months from now, I want to I wanna notice, you know, what are some other changes and shifts from doing the self-authoring program I am tracking, you know, when I am doing it, right? So this is public accountability that I am doing self-authoring program um, if I want to facilitate an, an engaged discussion about it. So... See you all later. Hope to see you at Supernova in Chicago where the women are going to be sharing their stories and their books and then also their online communities and further resources in regards to their self-directed learning, there's integrative psychology and, you know, your brain, um, which is really exciting, um, giving voice to things in society that are may, that may not have a voice, so we have a, an actress that is coming in to speak on that um, and perform in that. Um, and it's going to be at uh, Chill in Chicago, which is a beautiful sp space in the heart of the Loop. Um, which, right before I left for my exhibition, um, I went and did a meditation there, sat down, and it came right through in my brain. That this is the space I have to rent, even though, <laughs> it, it, you know, it's like this is way out of my comfort zone. So, um, learning and growing, as as we all do. All right, guys. Bye.